Mitchin Kitchen, we are making a fruit sparkler. And this fruit sparkler is perfect for New Year's or really any time you have kids around. It's one of those signature drinks just because they're kids doesn't mean that they can't have a drink, especially at New Year's time to celebrate the New Year, right? Yes. All right, so we want to show you how easy this is. The kids are going to love it, and it's something that you can prepare ahead of time as well. So let's get started on making this fruit sparkler. Here we go. In a large saucepan over high heat, add in six cups of water along with two and a half cups of frozen or fresh strawberries. Then add in two cups of sugar and 10 whole cloves along with a quarter of a teaspoon of cardamom. If you don't have cardamom, go ahead and substitute for an eighth of a teaspoon of fresh nutmeg. Add in a peel of one orange along with one vanilla bean that's been split in half. Bring up to a boil and then simmer for 10 minutes. Afterwards, strain into a large bowl and place your fruit juice in the fridge until it is cooled. We're going to pour our fruit juice into our picture. That we've already pre-made, right? Yeah. And then also, what are you going to add to this, Maria? I'm going to add in some orange juice. Mm-hmm. About two cups. To bring a little bit of sparkle to the mix, Maria's going to go ahead and add in some club soda and about two cups again. So we're going to fill it really pretty much to the top, Maria. And this is just going to add that nice little fizz to it. Such a pretty color, isn't it? Yeah, it's splashy. <laughs> That's perfect. Good, good. Very nice. Okay, go ahead and gently stir it. Mm. We're filling our glasses with fruit sparkler. And it looks absolutely delicious. We put a little bit of ice cubes in it just to cool it off a bit more. Now all we have to do, Maria, is... Try it! Exactly. All right, here we go. Cheers. Cheers to the New Year's. We served it in nice fancy glasses for the kids, right? Mmm. Mmm. Yum. You like it? Not so much? No. Really? <laughs> you don't? Oh my gosh, I taste the strawberries, I taste a little bit of the cardamom, and the vanilla. You don't like this? We want you to try this. I think the kids are going to like it. Maria's a little bit picky when it comes to stuff like this. If it doesn't involve chocolate, I don't know. Who knows, right? Yeah. <laughs> but we want to just take a special moment right now just to say thank you so much for all your support. We are now going on two years for Amateur Kitchen, and we just can't thank you enough again for all the support. I cannot believe it, time has flown by. As always, if you ever wanna see us make something, let us know and we will try our best to make it for you. Or answer any questions, of course, as well. Right, Maria? Yes. What do you think of the whole experience? It's really fun. It is fun. We get to eat great food, and not to mention that we're creating such great memories. So we hope you try and get in the kitchen with your family or friends and do the same as we're doing. In the meantime, we always want you to head to our website, amateurkitchen.tv, to find all of our recipes and videos, including this one. And then we also want you to head to our Facebook page, facebook.com slash amateurkitchen. And what do they need to do, Maria? Click that little like button. So you can follow us every single day. Well, at least I'm going to sit here and enjoy this fruit sparkler. We hope you try it too. We wish you and your family a very happy and healthy 2013. <laughs> and we want to see you right back here again next time on Amateur Kitchen. See you later. Bye.